So, Fitz, I have three words for you. Endangered loggerhead turtles. Fitz. 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 Hey, Fitz. Fitz. Hey, Fitz. Fitz. Hey, Fitz. Fitz, hey. I have the best story idea ever. And I got a great story idea for you. Have you ever heard of this guy named Joe Moffo? Joe Moffo. Joe Moffo. Joe Moffo. About this guy. His name is Joe Moffo. I was thinking about doing a profile on him. What do you think oh, about no. that? Catch some alligator. I think we should do a three-part series on gator hunting. I have this great story idea. Hey Fitz, I've got this great idea for a story. Hey Fitz, I have this really awesome idea. I found this really cool neighborhood on Hilton Head called Mitchellville. I heard of this group uh, called Gullah. Did you know there's an entire people descended from the freed slaves after the Civil War that still lives here to this day? Have you heard of these group of people called Gullah? Gullah? Apparently, there's this group of people who live out on the sea islands and they call themselves Gullah. Best story idea ever. Um, say, I was uh, talking to Daniel Brownstein. We have this really great idea for a special three-part series. Test scores are coming out. Sea turtles. You know, the first loggerhead nests are gonna, are gonna hatch. Forrest Gump was on TV the other night and it got me thinking, wasn't part of that movie filmed somewhere around Hilton Head? I got a 3,000 word column for you. It's by Irvina. It's about old people. I was driving down the Hilton Head the other day and I noticed you can't see any of the signs. A series of photos on, you know, people who are just comfortable in their skin and just go down to Cligny Beach and get some, you know, great shots of, of male nipples. What is a roundabout? World record cobia. Sure, but I'm gonna go out um, on the Tumors boat. I don't know if you know the Tumors. Worry but... about storm water runoff into the May River. Oysters in the May River. What do you think of that? I'm talking about the fact that the May River has these awesome oysters. We should do a story on it. Thinking 10 page spread. I'm gonna need some comp time for this one.